Hello everybody, welcome to the incredible round of 32 match between Ducky and PTK, two former champions. Uh, k Fog is he's on here. Joining me in the booth is, as you can see by the picture, he's Spanish. It is Faime. Hello. Hello everybody. We're here to watch uh, one of the best uh, probably matches that are going to be in the cup for a long time, at least on paper. Top coaches here with top teams. Yeah. So yeah, this is supposed to be good. Yeah, it's 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 in pretty incredible. Um, yeah, it is it is De it is Denmark versus Denmark. Unbelievable. Two cheeky Danes, a Dane off. <laughs> dance dance revolution, you could say. I mean, obviously on teams you've got to give the advantage. Well, on races, big advantage to Ducky because no are brilliant and Burt's are crap. But <laughs> it's quite a good team that that PTK's got with the add up guys, isn't it? Is is uh, killer is missed next door? That's why he doesn't have the four blitzers. So. Monstrous uh, the bread team with thick skull uh, <laughs> character there. Yeah. Controversial. <laughs> yeah, because he's yeah. Nigel. I remember that because he said it because he has a Nigel injury, so thick yeah. skull will help him. For me, it doesn't make any sense, but why am to know? You know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I I, I thought it was a bad idea, but he, he beat the he beat the guy he beat the vampires that he would have needed yep. to tackle for. And now he doesn't need tackle against Ducky, so it's paid off. Wow, greeting the hit there, he had five re rolls, I guess. Yeah, didn't like that that guy was exposed there from uh, from Ducky. You would have liked to have got him classic behind. classic dodge afterwards necro move there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, classic necro blitz. <laughs> Monstrous teams. I mean, Ducky has a monster team. The, the beast has uh, all the good skills that even block. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's 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 funny, right? Because even though it's like a good Nurgle team, it is just a few skills away, away from being a lot better. <laughs> yeah. But uh, he got guard. He had one of these just picked up guard off the last game. This one it must have been. So that was a great pickup for him getting the extra guard on. Um, and even the strength one, right, could have could have tentacles, um, but doesn't. <laughs> Killer with AG6, with armor 6, I've seen there. Yeah. Carrying some pain there, and Aki here, his favorite move. <laughs> Dirty players. Doesn't do anything. So inducement wise, K Fog has got a, got two bibs and an apple and a wizard, so he's got he's down quite a lot of TV here. The good thing is the breads have a lot of downlets, so that's gonna help mm. to compensate the brutal strength of the Nargle team because they have two five uh, strength players. Yeah. This is the kind of monstrous teams that are able to, you know, to win the cup because to win the cup you need absolutely a monstrous team something weird Maybe you need a lot of extra IG or strength or something like that because it's a lot of games and you need that monster players to be able to endure it yeah in the booth reckless Brandon is uh, me five me <laughs> the uh, which you would know if you followed the JFW every Monday and exactly. Friday <laughs> <laughs> The greatest wrestling commentator of a generation. <laughs> I can disagree with that comment. <laughs> oh dear. Hitting the fender with uh, the claw palm, but that's who he wants to hit, and he's still got claw mighty on him, hasn't he? Can't really afford to pile on against dirty players with armor six, can you? <laughs> you just got no, no, he no, almost no, hasn't no. even got piling no. on on that guy. <laughs> Spend and side step and guard. Absolutely name it of a player. Yeah. Oh dear, there's the uh, so there's the 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 apple comes in on that, but it is a send off, so it's not a full ducky foul. He, he did get the uh, he did get the cars, but he did get sent off. So I mean that's yeah, a nice so play to remove for the drive, isn't it? Having two apples, using the apple that is nearly mandatory, even if they are mixing his game. Because as soon PTK is PTK start losing players, that's it. Snowball and over. 
Yeah. Yeah, that was a half ducky either. Yeah. No, no AV break this time from PDK, so we probably will see a pile on from this fella. Uh, no, he's getting fouled, so we might not see a pile on from this fella. Nope, stunned again. So PTK really doing his best to mitigate the damage from this. Oh, cheeky dodge there. Yeah, very nice. And this is tricky for Ducky, isn't he? Because he's got to be wary of the wizard. And like, it's he's got he wants to try and push up. It's turn four. Initiating a bit of contact here. There it goes. The birds, one thing they have, they're very difficult to move, you know, to push to a side. There's a lot of fan, a lot of guard, dodge. Yeah, stand firm. So if he doesn't start uh, killing players, that's it. For example, there, that. Uh, Let's see the stand firm. Nargel Garrier the... is away from the, the poor half now. Yeah. Oh, he's going to pile on right next to the dirty player, <laughs> Mr. Foulbird. He's not gonna find out. He's not gonna pile on. He would have piled on. Him. So obviously, mighty blow hit is coming in instantly on the uh, <laughs> on the armor six. More six. I mean, I think Ducky is not very keen on protecting that player. <laughs> no, no, he's just he's just gonna use him until he. Oh, double one. Oh no, it was a one in nine. Oh, it was a double one. But, uh, it wasn't. It wasn't one of his edge four guys, was it? Yep. Nope. Interesting now, isn't it? Three players over here. Ducky's a bit, a bit separated. Uh, he needs to make a decision which side of the field he wants to use. Yeah. Gotta like try and jam back in the middle, hasn't he? I think. Oh, nice, nice removal there. Oh, that's very good. That opens the center. Yeah, well, only a shitty, only a shitty peasant, but still, getting the player off the field is nice, isn't it? And they, they do, they can get in the way a bit, can't they? Especially with Fend. Sometimes, sometimes, the very rarely, the, Fend is good. Uh, the beast is there. The the Lord's job there. Still pushing it tight, but it's it's, this is a very b finely balanced. I feel like just with the, the wild card of the wizard, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> that's the reroll in the pals. It is the thing. PTK doesn't need to get the ball or do anything. He just needs to stall or force uh, Ducky to stay there. Yeah. Nil nil. Half is a massive win for. Uh, the oh. Good. Only a stun. Yeah, but they're standing turn six. <laughs> yeah. So th this is a this is tough, right? Because he doesn't want to really. With this guy, he's a good position on the side step of there. So he's just going to push down the side. Yeah, okay, that's... Uh... Then that's taking all of his movement, so he's... I don't know how he's getting forward still. I thought maybe he's blitzing this guy and then blocking him with a claw pommer and then like moving over to this side. There's a lot of down the players left side. Here. Yeah, this is a bit... This is a bit... Uh, open, open the can of chips, the potato is here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is going to be GFI, yeah. And what, took him in behind or something? Ah, oh, and then dodge out. I'm not tagging him. I don't know, I see a is way to a, get one day, is this a one day on the ball. Yeah, it could have even been a wizard. I guess the good thing is all of the stink makes it hard to, like, you know, pass after, after bolting or anything, but... No wizard. Not even going for the ball. I guess the the beast has got these two guys, which makes 
the wizard or even the one doing the ball look very unexciting, doesn't it? Yeah. He got away from the tentacles, but one in nine the dodge it. In fact, it will one the dodge Biggie. again. <laughs> wow. That guy needs to be sacked. Terrible. Terrible dice rolls there. Now uh, Ducky has an easy way to the center of the field. Yep. He's not even gonna he's not even gonna blitz this guy. He's gonna uh, he's gonna get the claw mighty hit on that guy. And kill him. Well, there you go. <laughs> there you go. Result. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you eat that one. You eat that one. Yeah, yeah, he, he used his apple earlier, but he still has one left. But chooses to eat it. The problem with blitzing the IG4 is he uh, also has side steps so, and dodge, so you don't get him. You're getting him much closer to the ball. Yeah. Yeah, and then this gets this guy up as well, so this was. Which the better hit, probably. <laughs> Oh, and that's a lovely removal because that clears the space for the uh, for the warrior to go through to tighten this up. That was the problem, not having anything yeah. in this square, but now he gets to that square. Sorted, yeah. And everything's sorted. <laughs> and now PTK runs away. Uh, but, but that's not safe. Because <laughs> there's a club on my back here. <laughs> oh dear. Uh. <laughs> oh wow, that guy's getting three dice claw pommed. <laughs> he might have even been better standing on the sideline and hoping, <laughs> hoping to get. <laughs> Surfed like you know, you know, turn off sidestep yeah. and get surfed. I always like thought they were, uh, you know, there should be the option to surf uh, your own player, jump to the side, like you say, okay, fuck this shit, I'm out, I'm out. <laughs> oh, good job it was three dice. Ooh. And he casts him. There you go, Apple now. It works. Apple works. The only thing I've worked for uh, PTK this half. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this is pretty pretty brutal half. Pretty brutal half, K Fog. No no orc cheerleaders, very disappointing from Ducky. Letting the side down with with a lack of orc cheerleaders. <laughs> And he even failed one of the KOs as well on a 2 plus. At least it's a 2 plus for uh, next uh, next half. Yeah, yeah, true, true. He's got another try, hasn't he? Yeah, uh, but the PTK, yeah, the, those uh, two turnovers with a failed dodge. Oh, uh, <laughs> big punishment because he was doing right, you know, just keeping Ducky under control, uh, unable to advance. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was a pretty decent half apart from those two dodges. And amazingly, the both both times he he, he, roll, he rolled the dice to get away from from tentacles. <laughs> Do, doing the hard part and failing this one as classic blue ball. Yep. I'm not even going for the one turn here, just hoping for a riot. Not even going for a. Glorious. LOS, no, I uh, won't hits. give in. Yeah, I think he has another Until card. Until I'm get victorious. Uh, and I will defend. Oh, it gets boots. Oh, there you go. I will defend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is starting to look like a bit of a dicing, isn't it? Oh, yeah. It's not looking good for PTK here. <laughs> and just then, thank you very much, G Chimpo. Welcome to Team Fantastic. Absolutely glorious. Thank you very much. <laughs> I think we're gonna see the armor six. Yep. It's actually pretty good, isn't it, having that armor six guy? Because he can be the one know. that piles on and gets fouled because you don't really care that much when he when yeah. he dies. <laughs> another oh, another injury. <laughs> And both apples used at this point. Another niggling for the thick skull guy. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. 
That's so good. That's so good. <laughs> massive, massive punishment. <laughs> pure, pure cruelty there. <laughs> Love to see it. Still got to do it, obviously. Even though okay. Ducky doesn't really care about him that much, you've still got to stick the boot in. I think that was the Armor 8 one. Was it? Well, it doesn't yeah. matter. It, maybe he was the only one who could reach. Like, it should have been yeah, the Armor 6 one, I think, because uh, yeah, you know they, he's getting fouled. <laughs> <laughs> but if you can just yes, use it until it dies. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Mm, and cool. after all they have regen, you know, so okay, fifty percent there. Yeah. That's the good thing with Nargal, you know, all these uh, levels that uh, it's not only they can kill all your team, it's like you can kill them. <laughs> yeah. This is a nice little cell. Oh, it's, it's, it's just one square forward. I was like, this looks crazy, but it's just literally chevrons, but one square forward. <laughs> I was like, wow, this is a great sell. Ducky's a genius. What's this he's created? Oh, it's chevrons. You can't think discovered it after so many years. Blue, blue, yeah. It's, it's, a... <laughs> it's chevrons that doesn't want to see a, doesn't want to see a quick snap. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Blitz. Another bullet. And I think purple chest uh, just arrived. Oh, wow. Hello. Yeah, don't worry about me. I, I just I can't wait for the stream, and I know you're streaming it five seconds ahead if I'm watching in here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, the uh, verbal test. Go no, I thought I'd pop on in. I'm uh, quite interested. I didn't get to see this game. I have no idea what happens in it. It's been a bit of a dicing, to be honest. Uh, which is well, a shame, because these are two fantastic Blood Bowl players. So we could have had I have to tell you ball. that the... Pick a skull uh, player from a PTK that uh, choose pick a skull base in your uh, advice got niggle again. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean, I, I, when you say based on my advice, that's a little firm, isn't it? <laughs> um, when asking what skills he could possibly pick, uh, I did mention that if, as he was obviously going to live and die on the line, that thick skull was ab was a possibility, and I do think it is. Um, but clearly it didn't work. PC quick to distance himself from the Thick Skull allegations. <laughs> <laughs> the Thick Skull controversy is... Yes. <laughs> um, I, I stand, I stand by board. it. If something loses Apo rights and it's going to live and die on the line of scrimmage, um, then adding Thick Skull, if you don't think there's a, another skill that would really add to what it's going to do, that can be my a bad option. <laughs> Which is why Ooh, Goblin most... Trolls quite often take it. Yes. I mean, to be fair, they also only have strength access, so they, they run yeah. out of other good options. And yes. they, in the midst of that was an, a massive raid from Andy Devo. Thank you very much. Hello, oh. Andy Devo fans. We've got a fantastic Chalice matchup here between Ducky and KFOG, but unfortunately it has been an absolute dicing. There's been two blitzes for <laughs> two blitzes for Ducky. He's made five. Another cars. niggling. <laughs> it's pretty much over. Woo! What you're telling me here is that uh, his core has uh, inherited the Davo dice for this particular game. A little bit. Yeah. Brutal. Oh, Ducky has only made dead nigglings and business game. That's it. You know, it's the thing you don't need as well. When you're playing a, a top-class player, you, you need to get at least even dice. If, if they're top-class and you feel they've got a really nice team, because, you know, nice as these Bretonians are, they're still Bretonians, as we've touched on before. Yeah. Um, and against a killy Hawthorne team like this, coached by a great coach who then gets nice dice. Well, yeah, that's going to be a brutal time playing Blood Bowl, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, Kvog was one who needed the bed. I mean, Ducky's team is better, just for sure. It, may, maybe not if his fourth blitzer wasn't missed next, but with the with the blitzer out, it was just yeah. clearly, clearly far better team for Ducky. And I mean, depressingly, this is about as good as you can see Bretonians getting, really. Mm. So, yeah. Yeah. 
there is no much tools that this team could get. Also, when you get a wizard, an extra apple, and two babes, you know, it's like, oh, this is bad. This is gonna be bad. <laughs> yeah. Well, the way the whiz is still how this gets won, isn't it? We just we try and drive home and then turn over using the whiz and try and get a quick score in overtime, maybe. Maybe. Mm -hmm. no, it's not gonna happen, but yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> More likely, use your wizard to score in absolute desperation. And Just then to try and the stay time. alive for a couple of rounds longer. Yeah. Yeah, that. Um, <laughs> well, I mean, what can be said? You know, sometimes we all get terrible dice. I was on. Actually, Ando just, Andy just raised it as I was on Andy's stream having a little watch earlier. He's had a, you know, a day of very tough dice. It happens to everybody. Well, not if you don't play Blood Bowl, that is the only that's, way you play. That is the exactly. way of avoiding it, Jim, exactly. I have heard that. Exactly, that's the way. It's like the movie War Game. The only way to win is not to play. <laughs> yep. I mean, after all, the game is designed since the origin you know, to be a dicing game. Oh, it's a frustration engine. It, it yes. definitely is. Oh. Went for the it was it was a parody of a board game, and it's been taken too far. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> I mean, the first edition is absolutely mental. It's impossible to play the first edition series. It is, or, it uh, is. I mean, I did. I'm old enough to have done so, and each game took about three days. <laughs> and ended when the last piece on the field struggled over the line with a ball. Yeah. And you could hire assassins to kill the other team players before yeah, the game. It was, it was completely mental. Um, and it, it got refined somehow over time into a vaguely competitive but still incredibly variance prone board and dice game. Um, but still with that silly core at its heart. And, and why we all love it and venerate it is so important, I don't know. It is just a silly kids game. It really is. It really, really is. Oh, it's the power, game. massive power. Leaving the instant 2D on the ball. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's it's watching the position crumble when that's, you know, it's so inevitable with down this number of players. It's, it's brutal, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, there's still things that can be done. There are some nice agility knights on the pitch, which are, you know, essentially elves. I mean, they're also essentially dead. <laughs> <laughs> if the... Is, is, this is watching a team, whole team dies. <laughs> and Cora, of course, came with a nice long bench, didn't he? He did, yeah. He still got one on the bench. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. But of course, Ooh. Ducky here able to win every drive, which, you know, against long benches is all you need. You just stay up on numbers in the drive and don't worry so much about. You know, oh, 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 so getting to blitzes always helps. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Now they say in Blood Bowl 2020 um, that that's you know that the kickoff table and the kickoff results have been tamed. Um, I, I need to play it to be certain. It doesn't feel like it's changed particularly much, particularly on blitz. No, not a lot. Not even yes, kind of power, right? change. Well, this is promising. We've sort of got away from some of the bigger problems for a bit. Ish, can do some dodges. Oh, there you go. There you are, a couple of little two pluses. That's nice, but there is a tackle claw. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this all falls apart if you blow at it too hard. But, you know, it's, it's not as bad as it was at the start of the turn. If you don't look at the other team, looks nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, they did fix the they did fix the ridiculously overpowered passing problem that everyone complained about in Blood Bowl. Yeah, that's true. Yes, it is. It, it has been on all of our minds. Thank God that has been sorted. Out. Yeah, there's, there's orc throwers that were too powerful making passes and all that. You know, so they need to add a special skill only for them. Yeah. Well, just, <laughs> despite my fading eyesight, memory, and Blood Bowl skills, I do manage to remember that when this new rule set was originally mooted. That was the first thing said, was that it was going to bring passing back <laughs> front and centre of the game, that everyone was going to be able to pass. 
Mm, it's done the exact opposite. Woo! <laughs> oh, there you go. There is the bliss there. Turned out that was a lie. Yep. He's got the power. I think that uh, usually the people that design the rules for Blood Bowl is people that don't play the game, just watch games, you know, and they want to make things, you know, funnier and more interesting and more catastrophic uh, results, so they're more entertaining, but they are not people that actually play the game. I mean, the, the fact that the Apple fails is like, whoever designs this actually plays the game, you know, for long periods of time. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I mean, uh, sadly, I've met, well, certainly the man who, who calls himself Mr. Blood Bowl at Games Workshop. I'm not sure if that's still true. It was pre pandemic. Um, and he does play Blood Bowl um, quite often as dwarves. Mm, funny that. <laughs> funny that, isn't it? <laughs> it, it just, I'm just, you know, apropos of nothing, I'm just offering that little tidbit to prove that I've, you know, he's a real human with needs and desires. Well, he plays dwarves, oh. so maybe not that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've, I've only met him at a couple of tournaments, and at both of those he was coaching dwarves. I don't know that that's yeah. something he always does, I and mean, I suppose you could check NAF and prove that it is. <laughs> you can oh. indeed, yes. <laughs> you can, it's an, it's an option open to everybody. <laughs> and I believe someone has, and it, it does. But... <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if they fix throw a rock. I mean, it's still massively, massively brutal swing for the game. Um, throw a rock yes, is just not for the league good. season, is it? No. So it's, it's game impacted, but not season impacted, which I suppose is better. Yeah. Now, meanwhile, this game is still... You know, progressing towards its end. In fact, it's probably, time. it's probably more impactful well, on the game now, Throw a Rock. If Forge managed to put one of the knights uh, at the back there, the ball yeah. carrier. Yeah, yeah he's so. Chance. Yeah, he's. Uh... This is not looking that bad. Oh, that the really stupid made it because I was able to put tentacles on him. I mean, the suit, if any kind of super long punt, he can win that race. He's got the speed and the agility. Yeah. Um, if you can throw it from before the stink, over the stink, and way beyond, I mean, a, a nice lucky deep throw here could really solve all problems, couldn't it? Yep. Oh, that, is that a bit of a mistake from Ducky by putting an exit and sidestep away? Yeah, shouldn't, shouldn't from the stink. Been, yeah, However, he's, he's not there, Jim. That's... <laughs> That's how that gets solved. He's, he's in a better place now. He's not going to be there, is he? No, he's, he's, oh, he's, no, he's um, there. Eventually. He's still there. He has a pass. He has a pass, uh, probably a four uh, plus pass. <laughs> not anymore, but. <laughs> yeah, this, this doesn't look awfully safe, but I'm not sure where it could, so that, that was spicy. Mm. Okay, yeah, I can see. This sort of yeah. does, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. Pretty good. it's pretty good. He's doing whatever he can. GFI from the beast at the end to, to base him would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. Well, I mean, he is scrappy, but yeah, I mean, that's it's a last action, but absolutely. You know, he, I flatter myself I'm not dissimilar that you can be beating me, but you have to keep beating me, because I'm going to keep coming up with any idea I can. And Core, of course, is very, uh, very smart. Comes up with very good ideas. Yeah. He's not bad at football. He's not. Oh no, no, no! That's one thing uh, we all know. One of the best. Here we I'm go. not adding anything else. He is actually one of the best. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now, isn't Ooh. this a bit risky from Ducky? Just central. What's he's that. looking forward to intercept the pass? Yeah, that agility for knight is just sort of lying there. Yeah, interesting. Without anyone messing with him, yeah, I know I it's quite like a long way away from the ball, but I guess I mean, he's thinking about if he just put, if he just bolts or whatever and pushes up this side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is he, probably what he does. In the case, he has the wizard. So put that player on the touchdown there. Yeah. Oh wow! No, he's just elfing it. Oh, oh no, he's using the. Was that all appearing? Yeah, he is just elfing it. Wow. No, he, he, wait, what he tried the blitz, didn't he? He tried the blitz. He tried the blitz, but it got the full appearance. 
tactile appearance stopped him. Wow. So he just elfed his way out instead. He was trying to use Dauntless and blitz a hole. Wow. Having done only one dodge, but when foul appearance popped, instead of trying anything on it, he just uh, did the two three pluses. Because of course they're one in nines. And buggered off. So all it cost him in the end was a, a square of movement. Yeah. And Unfortunately that. Flattened. Yeah, that is a tackle piece. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good effort. I mean, it was uh, given the circumstances probably the best you could do. Yeah. I, I mean, no, the... yeah, and... I could say you could put the other agility blitzer on that piece to control it, but then he'd have just come with the beast of Nurgle and got the tentacles on it. There of are course. too many Nurgle uh, players. Yeah, yeah. Of course, if this too was Blood Bowl three, you would have had to declared uh, this Nurgle warrior as the target of the blitz, and then when he rolled a one on the foul appearance, he wouldn't have been able to do anything. So he would have had Ooh. to have re-rolled it. Yes, yeah, but you don't even get to here. you don't even get to start your move, do you? No. But in that case, he would probably no. not have declared it on the foul oh appearance. Oh my god! He would have declared it on the rotter. Oh, he still had the three plus for the pickup there. Oh my god! <sighs> With short hands. <laughs> Which would have and put him he... in overtime with a wizard, which would have given him a you know a reasonable shot. Yeah, despite everything. A horrible one in nine there. Well, I mean, with two fast agility players and a wizard, you can always get it done, can't you? Mm. I mean, it oh. wouldn't have been a great chance, but it would have been a chance. Oh, yeah, so even right at the end. Diced. <laughs> Diced to death. Well, I think many of his one-turner victims on his chalice runs will... <laughs> inwardly smile at this. <laughs> yep. Yes, the only problem is Ducky has to the next round. <laughs> so, you know, you know yeah. like, one of, oh, PTK is out, that's good news. Yeah, but... P <laughs> when did we allow Ducky to have a horrific kill team? How is that? <laughs> why, is, why is that okay now? <laughs> exactly. Yeah, that's not looking good for everybody else in the chalice. There you go. The toxic uh, path there, so voting. <laughs> Yeah, that was uh, that was something. Twenty-five AV bricks to eight. <laughs> yes. Eighty blocks. But the uh, eighty blocks to twenty-four. There you go. Um, Kfog just couldn't do anything, could he? he? Didn't have any players oh. most of the time, and outstrength massively, and outguarded, and it was just it was just horrible. Really, yeah. PTK whole game long. In the first half, there was a chance he was able to hold the line, but then two turnovers, failing one in nines, and that was it. Yeah. And then right at the death field, the one in nine. So yeah, it was not his day for three pluses. <laughs> yeah, and then two blitzes for uh, Ducky, you know, were like... <laughs> Absolute madness. Well, Yes, it's not what you want. <laughs> but congrats, Ducky. Commiserations, KFOG. Thank you very much, Femia and Pur Femia and Purple Chest. Femia? 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 Femia. 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 Uh, anyway, you pronounce it, it's all right. I'm not a uh, Taliban of uh, grammar. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> well, hey, on that bombshell, oh, I'll see what I did. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. <laughs> and stay fantastic. <laughs>